hello guys welcome back to the channel uh, first of all we have to create one virtual machine so come over here and search for vm instance and uh, open this in new tab and please uh, first of all uh, once you click on the instance create instance just scroll down a little bit and check that did you have the option to create of uh, it, it is enabled for you or not okay so now it's enabled for me so i will uh, create the instance if not I will just click on uh, refresh button okay so now what we have to do choose uh, US Central uh, N1 series so like this see US Central C from here scroll down little bit and make sure your machine type will be N1 standard one okay now for boot disk choose 10 select scroll down little bit in advanced option go to networking then click on this network interface click on this default then for IPv4 external IPv4 choose none okay now click on done and now click on create so we have create one virtual machine okay you can clear it okay done now we have to create another virtual machine so click on create instance you uh, europe west one like okay so you can see like that i uh, i need to change the name from instance one to instance two okay like that now us europe west one okay so scroll down a little bit europe west one you know, and zone must be c okay like that now n1 standard one n1 standard two okay so choose n1 from here choose n1 standard 2 like this and uh, windows server 2016 so come over here go here and choose for windows server and from here look for uh, copy this and uh, paste over here like this Two thousand sixteen data center, data center core, so like this. So yeah, we had done that SSD uh, like this, and it must be hundred. Okay, click on select. Then no need to do anything. Now scroll down a little bit and click on this allow HTTP and allow HTTPS. Click on create. Done. Now or version now this is a new part so we have to create another third vm but the reason and zone will be changed every time once you restart the lab okay so click on again create instance change the name into instance 3 it's already chosen so us central one and yeah so it's already uh, by default choose for me if not if, if there may be like us west one europe west one so i will uh, make a changes accordingly okay then e2 machine type custom come over here click on machine type custom and uh, for that 2 cpu 4 gb so it's already uh, by default chosen so no need to change anything and scroll down a little bit and uh, click on the change and make into uh, to 10 okay done now click on create like this and now you can click on create so yeah we got a score thanks for watching guys have a good day